All right, turning to more news here now, we've told you about the difficulty police departments across the state face in recruiting those who protect and serve. And tonight, another arm of law enforcement needs some help. News 5's Tracy Carlos is in Lake County, where the sheriff's office is struggling to find corrections officers. Captain Cynthia Brooks has worked for the Lake County Sheriff's Office for 37 years, working her way up from a corrections officer to the jail administrator. Never can she remember positions being so hard to fill. I don't think too many are really looking to get into the field of law enforcement or corrections. Uh, some of the things that are portrayed these days about law enforcement and corrections. There's a bad apple and no matter where you work, there's always a bad apple. The Lake County Sheriff's Department has hung the virtual help wanted sign. The decrease in manpower is causing an increase in overtime due to required staffing levels. The sheriff's office is looking to hire at least 10 corrections officers, offering what jail officials say is a competitive benefits package. They start out at about $24 an hour with pay increases as their years of service go on, both step raises and cost of living raises negotiated by the union. We have outstanding medical coverage. We have outstanding uh, retirement. But for Brooks, this career has been about more than just a paycheck. Well, I've had people call or stop in and say thank you. Uh, I had a lady stop in and say, you gave me a book uh, 17 years ago, and I read that book, and I've been clean and sober since. So I think I do make a difference. Qualified applicants must be at least 18 years old with a high school diploma, be able to pass a background check, and officials here tell me have a commitment to making this community better. We have information on how to apply on both our website and our app. In Lake County, Tracy Carlos, News 5.